Hello there, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arm of the Stock Swish reviewing the Stock Swish Show Play of the Day. This was a play of the day in the trade trading room. It worked. It was a nice trade, fast in and out, and also I called an option in this. It was more than 100% the first day, which, of course, everybody loves. So uh, very nice to have that. And actually, I said earlier today, I'm on a roll. Um, you know, I say that sometimes when I'm just every trade that I call works and I mean, I'm on a pretty long roll here now. I mean, we're five months into the year and I'm on a roll. So I don't know. I mean, I guess after doing this for 14 years, uh, it's it becomes easier and easier over time. And I think that's something that people just, they never stick with one thing. So never trading never gets easy for people because they, they don't know what they're doing and they never stick with one thing. But this was an easy read today. It would fall. And again, when I do a day trade and an option in something, then it's really, really good. So the stock closed here the night before at 148.26, opened down here in the morning at 136.43. I called the 135 puts, they worked. And again, nice trade. Uh, sometimes things continue, but I don't think it makes any sense to be in this because uh, it was such a big trade the first day out of the gate. And obviously the market right now at this point is reversing. We did the day trade here and got in and got out, had a nice drop, beautiful. So again, really, I like to do day trades fast. Options, I will hold it for a couple of days, but not if it goes really big the first day. Here's the whole day of this. And again, I called the 135 puts. Beautiful. I could have even done them out uh, for a shorter time frame, but you know, you never know. So I gave it a cushion and didn't even need it. Didn't even need it. And the low of the day in this was 130.64. Such a nice move, such a big move, such a nice gap. Bunch of things out this week, earnings as far as that goes, and we'll see what happens. So if you're interested in signing up for the Gap Options newsletter, you would receive the trades to your email in real life time. You would have gotten this. You would have made money. Uh, sometimes people make money so fast with me, they're so sh surprised and shocked, but they really shouldn't be. I think people are following me long enough that they know that I know what I'm doing. Again, 14 years. I'm doing this a long time. It's not just that I'm trading for 14 years. It's that I'm trading specifically Gaps for 14 years. So I'm an expert in reading gaps. That's how I predict where this is going to go. How did I know this would fall? How did I know this was a short to do a put, to short as a day trade? Because I rated the gap using my method. Now, if you want to learn my method, that's something I teach in a class once a month. So the next class is this weekend for May, May 21st and 22nd. I still have a few spots available if you'd like to sign up. You can email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Great job in Walmart. Had a bunch of nice emails today from people that did the trade, made money. Again, everyone loves when the options go the same day. Sometimes that does, not always, but today it did. So congrats to those people who did it and have a great day, everyone.